Great Britain, Europe, and the world. The biggest crowd that has ever seen a boxing match in Scotland crams Glasgow's Shawfield Park to watch world champion Benny Lynch defend his title against southern champion Pat Palmer. The first round, Lynch in the light shorts gets Palmer into the corner, but Palmer wriggles out. Palmer straight lefts are giving Lynch a lot of trouble. The champion can't get close enough to use his left hook. The second round is mostly a series of clinches, but one ill judge advanced by Palmer gives Lynch an opening and he scores with a blow that cuts Palmer over the left eye. In the third round, Palmer adopts a pronounced crouch. Ducking and countering, he takes the offensive and twice forces the champion onto the ropes. But it's in the fourth round that things really begin to warm up. Lynch's amazing quickness of foot is beginning to prove a vital factor. In the fifth and sixth rounds, the fight doesn't slacken for a second. And this is where Lynch's superb power and speed begin to tell, as he gets Palmer against the ropes. With the crowd's roar rising to a crescendo as they sense the end coming in the seventh round, Lynch goes all out for a finish. Both men are hitting for all their worth. Palmer, bleeding from the nose, takes a terrific punishment. He goes down for a count of six that's stopped by the bell. Now comes the round that proves to be the last. Palmer still standing his ground, but his vitality has been sapped. And Lynch lands his rights and lefts with an almost sickening monotony. Watch the final punches that lead to Lynch's victory. Lynch brings out his left, follows it with a punch to the jaw, left to the solar plexus, and Palmer's down. And out.